All right, here we are, St. Clair, PA, fossil locality. There's like small ones laying around everywhere around here. We already started digging a little bit. We'll get to there in a second. Ooh, that's a nice little one. Got some in the backpack. There's Shauna up there. And then here's where we're digging. Whoever dug here before undermined the heck out of it. But start digging that out and then maybe we'll go this way a little bit but you can see the the exposure is right in there and then we'll come back hopefully the sun don't set before we dig them out I can't do one arm digging. I'll be back. Taking a break. Mineral Mama took over. <laughs> and then we're gonna. We already started exposing yeah, somewhat of a big slab. Right yep, yeah, right, that's where it is. Like yep. Yeah. We'll take a quick walk and just see what we find on the ground. These are all tiny ones, but I, I still pick the tiny ones as long as they they grab my eye. A little walk down a little bit. And there's some stuff laying around here. And you can see a little exposure over here. The gun range off in the background. This is, I like this level, but it seems to be brittle. It breaks into smaller pieces. Looks like someone else tried it and that was the result. Another exposure in the ground. Almost very similar to the last one. You can see. Here's a spot I always like giving a shot for smaller ones. And a couple I can pick right off the ground here. But this is a little exposure. I might give a couple wax with my small chisel. These I can. These are almost keepers in my mind. There's another one. But this is the exposure right there. Let's see if I can get this one out while holding the camera. Might be a little shaky. Oh, 
probably butchered a little bit, but I'll keep these little pieces anyway. These little ones. I mean, they're really, you can get as many as you want for the little pieces. Busted this ledge up a little bit more. And like I said, this stuff's brittle and just falls apart. I may be able to get a bigger one though, right there. But some of these were here and some of them popped out. Just for me. Just on it for like two minutes. We're gonna walk back up the hill and go for the big ones again. But here is, yeah, this just shattered. You know, a bunch of little pieces. But I'll, you know, a couple of those are keepers for educational grade. What do I see? It's quartz. <laughs> I guess there is a quartz locality down here near St. Clair, in St. Clair. I see people, or I used to see people years ago selling it on eBay. It's, you know, the, the Tresco quartz is, is nicer, in my opinion. But the stuff here that's crystals... Supposedly the locality's near here. Someone was trying to explain to me where it was years ago. But I can never pry myself away from from this spot. Um, it looked like little needle needle quartzes and it had dickite, the mineral dickite with it associated with it. And I'm gonna go down here, collect some some small the smaller ones that I just shattered off the ledge and We'll go up and I'll take my turn digging. Another exposure. It looks like someone tried going in with a concrete saw. Now, they're a rookie because this isn't the exposure to hit with a concrete saw. I guess it's easy with no digging required, but it's really just, you're just gonna get you know, it's nicer than a lot of spots, but you're not going to get the sawed after ones using the saw here. And a saw is cheating. You don't need a saw here. This one's kind of cool. It's all jumbled up, though. But a nice collage of ferns. But that's not really what we want. We want the nice bold ones that or stand alone, or have, you know, a little darkness around them. Not just all jumbled together like that, but it's still cool. There's Mineral Mama busting her butt. Hopefully, we get her. <laughs> this is just getting the top slab off so I can get a bigger full slab. Come on, say hi. Hi. <laughs> <laughs> um... One. This piece gone because this piece is kind of crumbling, so I want to get beneath it to the parts that really aren't gonna crumble. See how that like all it's all like not gonna be part yeah. of the slab. I need to get this off so that the part down there. I call that the mush layer. Yeah, it, it is. It's weird. The slate <laughs> is so mushy that they're, they're not gonna find anything in there. Okay, yeah. so then with that cleared off, I love that color though. I wish I could get more of it. So then with like some of this cleared off, this is more than mush layer. Like look at that, that's not what shale usually does. Well, we'll get rid of that and then go for the stuff underneath. Yeah, that's what I want to do, is I go for this. I don't now. know if we have time to go in further, but we might. Then if we, we can go in further, we can get a huge one tonight. Yeah, well, because we the sun's going to set. Way. The sun's going to set for... If we can get the crumble layer off the top of here, we can get this thing right here. We did bring our headlamps, though. Yeah, but... 